Hi everyone, today Kiali version 1.89 release. Like other demos, we are going to check summary, this sprint, a highlights, preview of the next sprint, and finally a community discussion. Summary, the most of the work was done in the server side and some features that we did in the PC Savings plugin. Now about the highlights, I'm going to let Josune to talk about it. Thanks, Alberto. Uh, uh, yes, so this is a change that is related to the recently added match page where a user with access to the control plane uh, is able to see our mesh components like Istio, Kiali, or the external services displayed in a graph. Uh, so when you click on an Istio Day instance, you are going to see information like the namespace, where is deployed, the version, the control plane metrics, and some specific values from the Istio config map, uh, which has information like, for example, the mesh ID, or if MTLS is enabled or disabled. Uh, so we have done some changes to display now the full YAML for the, for the Istio config map. Uh, with the same information that uh, we receive when do in the command line uh, kubectl get config maps for Istio. So uh, this way we can have a more useful or complete information for the user. And we also have changed the format to have a more similar view of a config map instead of a table. Uh, where, where we are able to select uh, specific sections and we can also copy or download the full uh, config map if needed. And that's all about this change. Alberto, if you can go to the next. Okay, so another highlight uh, of this sprint is the, in the visualization of the ambient graph mesh. So uh, when we have an ambient mesh and we go to the traffic graph, there is a display option to visualize the waypoint proxies in the graph that are hidden by default. So to my, make a, a little bit more evident which are these new elements displayed, um, because the waypoint proxies are considered like part of the infrastructure, uh, we have included a batch icon next to the waypoint name elements to highlight the waypoint proxies. And um, the icon is also included in the legend of the graph, as you can see in this image. And this change was done in both graphs, the cytospe cytoscape, that is the default graph, and also in the pattern fly one. And well, it is important to mention that this is still a feature uh, under development, and we are still working on how to visualize the ambient uh, graph. And that's it, uh, Alberto. Awesome. Thank you, Yasune. Well, some notable changes, uh, we ready the Node uh, and Golan versions, some dependencies, and we improved the performance in pop and services when there are initial fears time while loading. And about bad pieces, uh, some aspects related with the OPC segment plugin, related with the communication with token, and an alignment in the operator side to guarantee the versions. Uh, well, for the next sprint, uh, you can see the peak in progress, working performance, ambient support, and more butterfly topology stuff, and our backlog issues to, for this sprint. You can see all the information related with in the link in, in the link of the project that there is about. And yeah, that is for the demo. And now I am going to shut down the recording to start the community discussion. Thank you.